Hey, I want to show you how to uh, work on developing a graphical user interface uh, when you've got multiple layers that need to happen. So here I've got an application. It's in a J frame. It has a menu bar. And then below that is a layered pane. And I have one panel in here already, which uh, contains a label and a button. Now, when, if I wanted to go and put another screen in, an additional panel, uh, you might be tempted to just grab a panel over here on the palette and drag it over. But what will happen there is it, you'll probably end up with it in the wrong spot. It'll get stuck inside of this other panel or in the menu bar. Um, everything gets moved around. It's pretty difficult. So here's a couple of tips. Over here on the where it says main layered panel, this is my uh, this is where I want the um, the next panel to be is inside of it, just like this one. I'm going to right click on the top level container here and choose, uh, where is it, add from palette, swing containers, and panel. That's going to put an additional panel in. See how it's at the same level as this one? It's over top of it, so you can see the little exclamation point there warning you that you've got things in sort of a weird place. And I'm just going to rename that, oops, second panel. And I can work with this now, but it is still kind of over everything else, which so it makes it hard to see things. So if you want to edit just what's inside of a single panel, right click on that container and choose design this container. And now, see in the design view, I'm looking at only that panel, not the entire layered pane and everything above it. And you can see that it's, it's emboldened here over in the navigator. So I can work inside of this one panel now. I can put a button in here, or a label, or whatever else I'm going to do. And that's all built inside of this one panel. And now when I want to go back to working on the whole application, right click on JFrame, design this container, and now I've got the whole thing again. Now once again, all of the stuff is still here, so it's still a little cluttered if I'm looking at the JFrame as a whole. But to, to work on any individual piece, you can just do that. Uh, one more thing I wanted to show you. Let me go back in here. Uh, let's say I have all these separate components, and I realize, oh my goodness, these things should really all be inside of another container. They should all be inside of a, maybe a J panel, an additional J panel on their own. Highlight the ones that you want, right click, and choose Enclose In. And then they have some options to pick from here. So, for example, maybe you want to enclose them in a panel. And now, we have inside of the second panel, we have an additional panel that I can now move around or resize and so on, which contains those components. So that's a quick way to sort of collect a series of different components together into one piece. Okay, well I hope that helps uh, make your user interface design a little bit smoother.